Guys, this is my second meal. So what we've got here is low fat cottage cheese. The macros are 5.5 grams of protein, 3.1 grams of carbs, and 0.4 grams of fat. And that's paid 60 grams, and that's the whole tab. You know about this thing if you got me on Snapchat. This is the magical stuff. You know, slow digesting protein, this will keep you full for a little bit longer. Hence why I have it as my second meal, just to bridge the gap between my breakfast and my lunch. Diet is key. I don't need to preach about this, guys. So what we got here is my weekly shopping. It's small. It's just a quick sample of what I eat on a regular basis. So we got a ton of cottage cheese. We got plenty of oats. Uh, we got tuna. We got bananas. You know, complex carbohydrates right there. And we got the proteins in the fridge. I got plenty of chicken. I got rice. You know, keep it simple for yourself. Eat things that you're gonna be consistent with. This is the same stuff that I've been eating since day one when i stepped in the gym you know i've been eating that every single day and that's how you gotta do it if you want to build a supreme athletic physique and that's how you're gonna see results so stick to it guys meal number three an absolute classic rice and chicken and mixed veg i have this meal three times a day it consists of 45 protein 30 to 40 grams of carbohydrates i have that on my mixed veg i don't season my chicken i like to have it plain but for me, that's ideal and it's a very convenient meal to have. All right, today I'm gonna to be skipping my session. Yes, I've said it. I'm gonna be doing some yoga rather than smashing out shoulders. Why? Who knows? But we're gonna find out in a second. Anyways, I've wanted to work on my flexibility a little bit, so I thought I'd try a yoga session. So let's find out. Rob, what's your opinion on that? Bro, I think it's a good idea. You think it's a good idea? Yeah. Rob does not approve. No, nah, it's right. a good idea if you want to pick up chicks, but... Okay. Anyways, all right. <laughs> All right, okay, so like I said, yeah, I'm gonna be doing yoga with my boy Ash. You know what to expect, like. I'm expecting to be flexible by the end of it, <laughs> yeah. to be honest with you. This is my boy Ash. How we doing? I think it's a slogan for you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Getting It Done. Getting it nah, but shit, we get shit done though, for real. Honestly, yeah, we do shit get done. shit done. That's it. You know I mean? But today, today, like, you know, we decided to skip our shoulder and arm session to do yoga. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> you gotta get them yoga games, bro. Mm. <laughs> this is the wrong way. <laughs> Alright, guys, I think we're a little bit lost. I'm not too sure where to go. Alright, bro, can you read? Thank you, I appreciate it. Alright, if you guys are in Oxford, check out Ellie. Sweaty Bethany. Sweaty Bethany. Downstairs. Uh, and live, learn, love yoga. That's it. That's it. That's it. Check it out. <laughs> check it out. So right now I'm going to the gym. Yes, I just finished doing yoga. It was pretty sick. So right now, it should roughly take me a few minutes to get there. So we'll see. So I'm gonna hit a quick shoulder session. A little bit light, nothing too heavy. Uh, and then if I go time, I'm gonna do some on my hip thumb, biceps, but we'll see. But I'm pretty sure Ash wants to train biceps tomorrow. But tonight I want to be training on my own, so you know nothing too big, nothing too heavy. I'll try to keep it reasonably light. I don't even know if I'm gonna have anyone to film me. But either way, I want to get a bunch of highlights for you guys. I 
Welcome to yoga. I feel pretty good right now, so we'll see you in a sec. was just a quick workout that I managed to get out so what I was doing was targeting the rear delts lateral head and front delts I did a bit of traps but all in all the whole entire session was just based on focusing on the motion and getting something out of it alright guys to kickstart off the session I started off with some lateral raises closely paying attention to my form keeping my torso upright so the idea is to drive as much power in a lateral motion to really target the delts aka the lateral head i kept it light i didn't go too heavy so i started off with 12 kilograms 35 reps two sets before moving on to the next set all right on this set i believe i picked up 17 kilograms so that's a fair bit of weight but again really focusing on that form and keeping the torso upright really driving in a lateral motion to really target the lateral head but with this once you start struggling my best advice is kind of lock your core as well as your glutes and that's going to help you to stay upright all right next exercise for the rear delts so i'm doing rear delt extensions on incline with the bench this is a very good exercise to really isolate the rear delt but again it's all about form so keep a nice tight form really focus on really driving those delts back and the elbows up and you're gonna really you should feel it between you should feel your traps squeezing as well as your rear delts pinching Next exercise, front raises using a bar on the cables. This is a very good exercise to isolate the delts. I was hyperextending the movement, so I was bringing my arms a little bit closer to my ears to really target the upper uh, front delts and to really get the separation between the delts and the chest in the front. So with this exercise, I was doing between uh, 12 to 15 reps and then put a little bit more weight, eight reps, and then keep changing until failure. Alright guys, last exercise. This is by far one of my favorite exercises, shrugs. Alright, if you're looking to build that upper body, that thickness and width, shrugs contribute to that. So with a combination, you know, with a bigger back, wide shoulders and big chest, your physique will be complete. So I hit shrugs on a regular basis twice a week. So I do anywhere between eight reps to 20 to 30 reps. This requires a lot of volume if you want your traps to grow because it requires a little bit more work. But trust me, once when you start doing this exercise, you're gonna see your physique transform. All right guys, that's a wrap. That was a quick delt workout showing you how you can improve your front delts, lateral head, rear delts, as well as your traps to build that thickness and width. I highly suggest adding some compound movements to this to really build power and strength and bring up your upper body. But if you guys are looking to take your physique to the next level, do check out my comprehensive training guide, a 35 page training guide that illustrates everything that you should be doing to build mass from eating to training i'll put the link in the bio for my website but guys don't forget to click that subscribe button so stay tuned for more